Hi girls, it's Victoria, and I'm back with steps three through five of the science of happiness. How are we feeling after last week? Did you try out the activities in the video? I know I got into my state of flow quite a bit last week to get rid of my stress. Did the activities work for you? If not, I have some good news. We have three more activities in this video. So what are we waiting for? Let's get the party started and move on to step three. Step three, get happy through others. Now my favorite activity for this step is to make a gratitude visit. But what's a gratitude visit, you ask? That's a great question. A gratitude visit is when you visit a friend, family member, troop leader, or someone who is special to you and thank them for helping you in some way. Now I understand that most of us are under stay at home orders right now. So for this step, we're going virtual. An important part of maintaining your happiness while social distancing is making sure you're staying in contact with your friends and your family. It's important to remain social even though you can't physically see someone. So with a parent's permission, use a virtual platform like FaceTime or Zoom to have a visit with your someone special. For my visit, I chose my mom. Say hi, mom. Hi. Step four, do a helpful happiness experiment. For this step, we're gonna take what we learned and try to spread happiness. So did maybe one of the past three steps stand out to you or one of the activities work better for you? Pick a friend or a family member that you think would be interested in learning about the science of happiness or one that could possibly use a quick pick me up and try to teach them the activity. Mom tricks are loving, generous, dependable, positive, strong work ethic, and protective like a mama bear. Step five, create a happiness action plan. Have you ever created a bliss box? What are you waiting for? A bliss box is a box that you fill with anything that makes you smile or reminds you of happy moments. You could write down quotes to put in your box or even find pictures and souvenirs around your house to put inside. Whenever you're feeling down, open your bliss box and take a look at the things you put inside. Remember to continue to add to your box as what makes you happy changes. And with that, you have the five steps to the science of happiness. I hope that you found these activities useful in creating your happiness and that you're able to put these practices to work over the next few months. And if maybe you need one more suggestion, I do have a little secret of my own. You could always dance it out. Peace out, Girl Scout.